I've decided to try a new boot for the motorcycle. So this is my standard motorcycle boot, which is the lung version of the calf. I've also got these winter boots, which are a bit shorter. But with these, they do kick out quite a bit and it pulls your, your trousers kind of sit a bit further up. And my favourite were these, the Bella, the ankle boots. Now I love these boots, these are great in the summer. The only problem with these short boots is the toe part tapers quite thin at the front so it squashes your toes together. And the other thing is the soles quite thin and it's Especially when we want to, if you're off the bike doing some walking, they're not that comfortable to walk in. So, me new idea. Is these vans. So I've picked, these are the bad boys. And those are, let me just read the box, the Skate High Gore-Tex Tax MTE3. So they're brand new from Vans. They're Gore-Tex. So what we've got is a waterproof boot, ankle boot again. It's got the all-terrain sole and grip. And it's quite thick, that sole is. So it feels quite strong. It's also got this the rubber toe piece. It's also got this what goes over the top of the toes, which is quite thick rubber. So that'll work quite good for gear selection. So it's full on Gore-Tex. They are also thermal insulated. So that should be ideal for cold weather as well. If you can see the tongue, fits into there so you can kind of up to about there let me check yeah up to about that that eyelet you can stand into water to that eye and it won't penetrate into the boots tongues Gore-Tex as well so there they are MTE made for the elements cold weather Gore-Tex Duratherm I don't know if you can see inside it's got this thermal, thermal material, and the insole, the insole is absolutely brilliant. Look how thick that is, and that's a memory foam. Ultra Cush, Cush Day. So that's going to be me new motorcycle boots. I was looking this last few weeks for some new boots them ankle boots were perfect when we went to Switzerland this year but the only problem I had is a couple of days we had some heavy rain and my feet got absolutely soaked so I've been looking for some Gore-Tex boots there's a lot of full length boots but I didn't want full length I wanted more of the ankle boots and a lot of the ankle size boots, they're like these, they're like the Formula One type style and they're all kind of similar, they're quite narrow at the front and the sole, there's not a lot not a lot to the sole but obviously my feet got absolutely soaking wet so I wanted the same style, so that's what I've gone with that's what I compare to so they should be quite good they should be quite comfortable as well so the good thing as well with going on tour previously i had to take those and a pair of trainers for obviously when we're off the bike or we're going out got some trainers to wear with these i'm now got a bit more space saving i only need one pair of shoes often the, the dog's danglies all track sole that's it all track it's called but they are as strong as anything 
that bit's going to be great for the gear selector. So I got myself some trendy bike boots. 100% waterproof as well. So they should be nice on the bike and off the bike. All I've got to do is try them out. So I'll have to make that another video. So there we go. That's my new bike boots. The Vans. What they're called again? Vans. Hold on. Vans. Where's the box? Here's the box. The Vans Skate High Gore-Tex MTE3. They were on the van store. I think they're 180 pounds. I saw them in the Black Friday sale, and that was 119 pounds. So I went online. I says, "Lovely job, late. I'll have myself a size 10. No size 10s in stock. They're completely sold out everywhere." But I found the local van store close to me in the ball ring in Birmingham and got one pair of size 10s left. And these are them. So I managed to get some at £60 cheaper. That's it. Next video is wearing them. Oosh.